Hello YouTube, it's Minecraft Grand, the Geeky Minecrafter, coming at you with another Let's Play video here at Minecraft World. With me today is Leara, one of my new favorite people to hang out with and Minecraft with. Say hello, Leara. Hello, Leara. <laughs> with your little head on the swivel. <laughs> <laughs> so, Leara and I have been so busy the last few days, wouldn't you agree? Absolutely. In fact, I want to take you guys around and show you just a couple of the things that we've done. Uh, first is my cactus farm. Now we put it in, oh, look right there in front of us, it just bounced. So I've used glass panes to set the sand on. Um, as they grow up, they're hitting those glass panes and dropping into the water flow. Oh, now, there went another one. I know, it's, it's producing really, really well. In fact, I'm betting that my hoppers are almost all full. Now it currently doesn't lead anywhere. I've got the input line. Oh. Um, I've got uh, I've got this output line. Oh yeah, see it's starting to back up. Let's see. Oh, I have a torch in that one. Here we'll take <laughs> that. Yeah, so quite a few. Uh, quite a few of the hoppers are full and they they drop down underground right here and they pop out in the um, in the sorter room which is our project for today just FYI we're gonna be working on the sorter uh, and so it's it's backing up I really need to get this done uh, so that my cactuses can flow or I guess cacti would be the correct term yes my cacti can flow into um, chess and see, right now, I, I don't think I can reach it unless I get up on something. My mouse is doing weird things. See, it is full all the way up to here. So I am going to have to create the input line to deal with this. So it, that's that's heavy on the, uh, on the to-do agenda today. Now, after Leara went to bed last night, I spent some time in here dressing my walls and my ceiling. Uh, I haven't done my floor yet. I ran out of steam. I really like that ceiling. The polished diorite is nice. Thanks. I, I, I think I need to do some kind of lighting up there. You know, this room... Probably a good idea. Yeah, this room is going to be really... You know, it is really big. Now, I am going to fill it up with these modules, but um, I, I, I don't want any mobs in here. So I, I may need to, at least in the open public areas I may need to put some kind of lighting in. Now as you can see from where these two line up I'm only going to have, what is that, one, two, three, four spots in between the chests and so this will be a hallway when it's all said and done. You won't see any of this other stuff. So technically I didn't have to dress the walls. I'm just a Virgo and anal retentive so <laughs> I know it's there. And it looks very nice. Thank you. You're welcome. So we, before we begin, I know we're, we're already four minutes in, but would you like to take them over and show them what we've finished at the slime farm? Oh, I think that would be wonderful. So I'm going to give, give uh, I, I paused it to let her have time to run to her portal. She doesn't have a home pet point set up where I am. But maybe you ought to rethink that. Yeah, I agree, because I do spend quite a bit of time over here. So the process or the goal here today is to get at least one side done. I, I'm, I think we can do that fairly quickly if we assembly line it. Uh, I have some, um, you know what I don't have enough of? I don't have enough of the stone brick. You know why? Because I used it all on the walls. <laughs> <laughs> Oops. Okay, all right, so I'll go fetch some more of that. I'll be right back. Okay. So I got two stacks. So here's what I propose. Okay, so we're going to do the first 64 rows. Are you ready? I'm ready. Me too. Will this go down? Nope. Okay, I have to start with trapped. What's going on with my mouse? Okay. You've been having a lot of trouble with that. I know. I. You know what it is? I. My mouse is uh, a couple of years old, and I'm pretty hard on him. And I think it's just about to give up the ghost. Mm. Okay, if you could grab some of those hoppers. Okay. 
and uh, start feeding hoppers into these chests? Will do. Okay, since this is pretty boring stuff, I will in all likelihood speed build this and just play some music. I think that's a good idea. So far, they're okay, all okay. They're Good. letting me. I did every other one, and then I came back, and I'm doing the ones you're unlocking. Good, good, good. <laughs> right. So if you do come on the server, and, I, and I'm speaking now to YouTube because you already know this, right? So we do have some built-in commands like C persist. So because we have the ability to lock all your chests. Uh, you may be communicating, you may be working with a, a teammate, a player, and you may want to unlock the chest for that player. Well, you can do slash unlock, but that unlocks it for everyone. If you do C modify and then the player name, you can allow just that person or group of people, frankly, to get in there and then um, they'll have access to it. That is such a nice feature to be able to select. Yeah, with C persist and then you do C modify and then the player name and you just go hit them all at once. Oh, it saves a ton of time. Yes. Big help. Okay, so next is we're going to need some stone. Okay, I've got some in my inventory. Okay, you see this T that I'm standing on? Oh, actually, I'm sorry. Uh, next is the repeaters. Again, okay. lesson learned. <laughs> Oh, right. Right. Get those in first. Yeah, so I'll bring you um, a stack. Okay. My mouse is still a little, oh. And they're all set to one? Yeah, they're, they're just defaults. Okay. Okay, here's you a stack. I thank you. Got them. And unfortunately, you can't spam click. Otherwise, it starts resetting the. Oh right. So you have okay. to you have to do one click for each one. And you know what? I didn't. I did this right up to the wall. So I may I may knock a temporary path through. There we go. I'll clean all this up later. <laughs> here, I better put a torch down. I'll come back and some dang zombie will be in here. Want Did you haul yourself in again? A little bit. <laughs> Just a little bit. Okay. Oh, you've got it all the way down? Sweet! Yeah. And I'm going to throw some more torches because I've got some seven areas. Um, but if I throw them right next to you, that's where the block needs to go. So I'm going to do them one away from the uh, repeaters. The the wall would be great. Okay, I will do that. Just because I'm going to address the stone. Okay. 
Oh, this this mouse has a little bit of a. <laughs> Not gonna complain. It's better than the other one. I've never used anything other than just a regular two button with a wheel mouse, so oh, it'll no. be fun to have something special. Should I start laying down stone brick like you've done? Sure. Okay. Nothing special, just just in this what you've pattern. Done. Yes. Okay. And uh, if you want, I'll go high. You go low. Okay. I, I can do two. You can do two. Good. Two or one. Well. Oh, I I I see. Got okay. it. Oh, this is going really fast. Assembly line. Many hands. Make light work. Right. Henry Ford knew what he was doing. He did. Now, I, part of this is I have spent, what, a week gathering everything I need into one location so that we could just come and do this? It's a lot easier to get all your materials up front rather than having to stop and go back. And a lot of the time, that's what I was doing. A lot of the other builds, I would have to stop, run, go over here, get that, construct this. Yeah, just lesson learned. That's so what I was doing yesterday. I thought I had enough materials to do my watchtower, but I ran out two or three times and had to run back and get more, gather more, because I didn't even have them in my chest at my base. Wow. Are we doing the other side now, or have you done that already? The other side? The other half. You've already completed this, I can see. Yes. Uh, but I am out of redstone. I am going to have to go get some more redstone. So okay. I'm going to pause the video for just a second, because I also need to give my mom some pills. I'll be right back. Should I put comparators in while you're gone? You can. Yes, ma'am. They're in this chest. Got it much easier. It really is. The other one made my poor little brain hurt. <laughs> right. See? It made me think, which is really rude. Uh, right. <laughs> Just should not be doing that. No. Okay, so I think I have enough redstone. So you said you got the comparators done while I was in there. Uh, yes, I did. Let me... Okay, so um, do, you, do I have all the redstone or did I leave some down there? There's none here. Okay. So I have it all. I will share okay. with you. All right. Where you are. I'm coming up. Okay. Here I am. All right. So one, two. Thank you. Got them. And I'll do two. And so, oh, actually, yeah. No, it's just three per line, isn't it? One, two, three. Yeah. Do you need to start your video again? I did. We're recording. <laughs> oh, we are. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Nothing so, special, just three? Yeah, just, uh, I actually, I, I like running like this because you can do it fast. Oh, right. You can just spam it. Right. Because okay. this one is next to the comparators. We don't have to, oh, I just failed. Well, <laughs> we don't have to worry about anything. Whoops, except falling off. I learned so much from you. All these extra little tips that make life easier. Well, yeah, because I build big. Oh, lost my uh, my redstone. Ran out. I build big, so there's a lot of repetition in what I do. Oops, once again. Uh, what is this, I'm the just, wall? I'm just going to run back and make sure that we got everything. Yeah, it looks good to me. Yeah, I don't see any gaps. Okay. Yay. Outstanding. So, you know what it's time for? Oh, we look going at this. to do a test? Uh, well, we have to hook up the input line, and I'm looking at this. My input line is one off. <laughs> Oops. I can see that. Yeah, it's going to hit my OCD, but I am not going to change it. It's a feature, not a bug. <laughs> right? Uh, let's see. Okay. Do a couple of those. Let's put these back. I think, 
You know, you're you're talking about maybe doing the other side. Um, I, I think we're going to have time for it. I won't I won't put it on the video, but I I definitely think we're going to have time for it. I do too. This just went so quickly. Okay, so there's uh, there's a couple of stacks of hoppers in there. So let me see. I need. Uh, Let's see, this one's going to go down and over. So let's uh, line that bad boy up. There's a one. And we're going to feed it right in here. Oh, why is it? Stop doing that. <laughs> Just stop. There we go. It's the timing. Oh, nope, this one's wrong. Yep, this one goes... Okay, this is the input line that, that runs across all these. Oh, you know what I don't have is filter items. Um, let me think. What am How I... How many do you need? Well, four for each hopper in the input line. So, and we have a little less than uh, 64 inputs, so 64 times four. And I'm thinking maybe sticks. I've got a little bit of wood on me. Want me to make uh, sticks? There's wood in that chest right over there. Okay. Yeah, if you could make, uh, make us some sticks to put in here. And I just won't run any sticks through the um, inputs. I do not see wood. It might be in the bottom one that, chest. The chest that's. I see chests. Oh no! Forget, forget rule one. <laughs> really? You found an occasion where you're not always right. There's always an exception that proves the rule. <laughs> right. um, so now we have two stacks of 64 sticks. Was that enough? Two stacks of six, Yes. Okay. Yes. Uh-oh, what is happening here? Oh, I forgot my hoppers were full. Oh, right. It's just going to flood in. Right. I'm going to take one of them out and see if that will stop it. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Yeah, I can't take uh, I can't take any more out. Yeah, I've been throwing stuff in that input line for a while now. <laughs> well, I was trying to get over this quickly, and now that that this one's in, I can't jump it. Right. Okay. Well, um, all right. I got no choice but to go over here and offload. I pulled stuff out of those hoppers and I got lots of stuff. I'm just going to put them in here for now. Beef. <laughs> I don't understand some of this. After you do that, do you want me to toss the sticks to you? Uh, yeah, or you can start putting them in. And you want one stick just across each row in the C Come over on chest. this side. Okay. Okay, so the hopper that is not pointing to a chest, meaning the one right above the comparator, you're going to have... Are you looking in the hopper? Uh, no, I'm not. Uh... Above the chest. Yeah, hold on. Something just happened. Why is this... Uh... Huh. Do I have something wrong? Because it's trying to... It's trying to feed it. Hold, hold the phone just a minute. Let me debug. Got nothing and nothing. So see, it wasn't letting anything through. That's good. Oh, it let a bunch of stuff through this chest. Hmm. Curiouser and curiouser. 
So now we have hoppers that are four tall, correct? Uh, yes, the top one is the input line. Right. Um, things that you add will flow through there. And the one right below that is the one that you were referring to that does not go into a chest? Correct. It's the filter line. Oh, okay. So you put, you fill up the, the back four spaces and what goes in the front is whatever you hope to get in that chest. Okay, so I should put four sticks from right to left in each one. Correct. Okay. And I'm trying to figure out why they drop through. Oh, they don't now because there's no signal. Good, good. Okay, so four sticks left to right or right to left on the next ones. And then um, now it's time to decide what goes where. Okay, so I'm going to be entering this room from here. Oh, yeah, you know, it's... Hmm. It depends on whether or not we're going to get the other side up tonight. Up to you. Yeah, I'm going to come around and help you because I can think while, while I work. May I have some sticks, please? Yeah, and I'm not going to have enough sticks to um, do the whole thing. Oh, well, then take those, keep those, and I will go get my own. Okay. Does that sound like... Oh, I see. As you do that, the comparators light up. Yes. Meaning so that's how I know that I haven't missed any. Right. That's nice. I was going very slowly to be sure that I didn't skip any, but when they light up... That's, that is helpful. Makes my job easier. Right. I'm going to have to go upstairs and get some more wood. I really thought the stack of logs I brought down was going to be enough. Well, it wasn't a stack of logs. It was a stack of planks. No, I started with a stack of logs. Oh. Did you make more chests? Is that where they went? Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Okay, I'll get another stack. It's okay. I've been logging. I didn't do any logging today. Since no. we started the slime farm, I sort of haven't done the things I normally do. I like to do a little logging and a little mining and, you know, a little of this, a little of that oh, each yeah. day. Yeah. And I've just sort of been concentrating on slimes. Slimes have become my life. <laughs> uh, right? Okay, I'm going to run through. Excuse me. I'm going to start Oops. this in and meet you back. Don't track mud on our redstone. Right. Two, three. Now, what I, one thing I've learned is if you don't pre-fill that first slot, then whatever comes into that filter first wins. So the things you put in most often wind up being at the nearest part of the input line. So it's just a good rule of thumb to go ahead and pre-fill. If you, if you care about where they're going to land, then you need to pre-fill that front slot. If you don't care, then you just let... Uh-oh. What just happened? What did just happen? Uh, well... I'm not too sure. I... It, it jumped from one hopper to the other. Huh. Curiouser and curiouser. And the item that you put in the first slot has to be stackable for it to work, right? Yes, and it has to be stackable up to 64. Oh, right. Signs eggs and will eggs. Break it. Yes, signs snowballs. too. Snowballs. Yeah, that stuff will break it. Okay. I'm out of sticks. Oh, here's some more. We're almost done, though. Yeah, thank you. Mm -hmm. I can't believe how fast this is going together. <laughs> right. Well, this is like my sixth one of these. 
So, you know, you just learn over time. This is, this is what, oh, man, you jumped right in front of me on that one. Sorry. Sorry. Pays to hire a specialist. It does. Okay. So this side is done. Amazing. Done. You want to test it? Absolutely. That's the fun part. It is. So I think I'm going to need a couple of uh, rows of redstone. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put in this very first hopper, the filter hopper, 64 redstone. And it will drain down to 41. You know you're you're successful when it stops at 41 and so right now what we've done is give it enough power that when more redstone comes in on top like that that fires that fires that redstone and it causes it to flow into this I wonder why the 41 is the magic number well it's 18 if it's a single chest it's 41 well, actually it's 45 because you have to count the four that are also in there. Oh, right. Okay, so 45 for a double chest, uh, 18 and four, uh, 22 or 23 on the uh, single chest. And that's just what activates it. Yes, and huh. once it reaches that level, then anything you add above that causes those compare raters to fire, causes it to drop down. Okay. So that's Good it know. it's working it's going in the same place now if I put wood in it will automatically start in the next row now I'm not gonna do that because I don't want wood right there uh, I'm gonna worry about choosing my order when I'm not on camera and I have a few minutes to think about it because yes I think I mentioned it before I'm anal retentive so, uh, I want to do it right the first time. I tell you what, we've got a good test. Let's hit your mark. Come, yep, there you go. So this is Minecraft Gran and Leara signing out. We hope you've enjoyed this video. We hope you've enjoyed watching us build this sorter. If you did, smash that like button. Go ahead, you tell them, Leara. Maybe they're not listening to me. You have to press that like button. That's what gets us found. That's right. So we're just a couple of grannies over here building stuff. We hope you enjoyed it. Stay tuned for the next video. Uh, we'll continue with the sorter room, and uh, I'll probably walk you around my organization. Till next time, happy mining. Bye.